Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to make Windows Media Player the default playback program for audio and video files on Windows 10. Similar concept will apply for Windows 8 as well. And we all have probably heard of Groove Music at this point, but some of us want to go back to the Windows Media Player for all audio file playing purposes. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to begin by opening up the Start menu. Just want to left click on it one time. Type in Control Panel. Best Match should come back with Control Panel above Desktop App. You want to left click on that one time. You want to set your View By up here to Large Icons. And now you want to left click on the default program section. Now you want to left click on set your default programs. Make a program the default for all file types and protocols it can open. So left click on that. And now if you're on Windows 10 it should open up this new window. If you're on Windows 7 or Windows 8 it shouldn't do that to you. It should still be within that same window but Windows 10 they're trying to direct us to this new interface here. So now you want to go down and where it says music player, if it says group music, you want to click inside it one time. And then just set it to Windows Media Player. And you can also scroll down a little bit further. You can see if there's anything else in here as well. You can also, which I would suggest, which will look more familiar if you're using other versions of Windows. So if you choose default apps by file types, if you left click on that, Again, this would probably be what you see if you clicked on Set Your Default Programs and you're running an earlier version of Windows. But there should be a bunch of extensions that come up in a list and you just would want to change them to Windows Media Player as your default. So this should open up something that's somewhat similar, but again, I'm on a Windows 10 computer, so that's what I'm going to be showing you guys for this tutorial. So you want to go over on the left side here if you had any specific file types you want to change, so any like .mp4s or whatnot, just scroll down the list and you'd want to make sure Windows Media Player was set as default for them. So you can see how many actually are controlled by that, so it's very interesting when you think about how many file extension types there are. And again, like I said, you can go through the list, just see what kind of extensions you're looking for. There's a whole bunch of different extensions that could go for Windows Media Player. So it's just something to think about. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.